Since 3D printing burst into the public consciousness just a few years ago, the technology has been revolutionizing industrial processes, such as the manufacture of car and aeroplane prototypes and parts. It's also being used in medicine, where clinicians are using conventional 3D printing to plan surgery and implant prosthetics. 3D bioprinting is a complete change of paradigm. Where conventional 3D printing is a structural process, 3D bioprinting adds biological function to the printed product. We can add biological properties to implanted tissues such as bone and may eventually be able to manufacture organs for transplantation. In short, we will print live objects. When bioprinting new tissues for surgery such as bone, we combine biocompatible materials like cellulose, fibrin, collagen or spider silk to build up a scaffold. The patient's own live cells and extracellular material are used to fill it, expanding after implantation to give it the complete range of biological properties it needs. The possibilities offered by Ebex 3D Bioprinter are endless. In the field of personalized medicine, 3D Bioprinter has the potential to reconstruct organ replicas, again made with a patient's own cells, for the functional testing of different treatments. Not only that, but 3D bioprinting could also be used to print small pieces of organs for applications in industrial processes, such as skin, for the quality control of dermatological products. Ebex 3D Bioprinter is the only one with this high level of precision and the characteristics to be used for regenerative medicine purposes in Southern Europe and one of the very few on the continent. With its investment in its 3D Bioprinter as a key to future of regenerative medicine, Ebex has made a strategic move to support hospitals and the industrial sector working in the field. We've taken the responsibility to make this technology available to researchers, clinicians and companies in Barcelona and in Europe. Now you too can play your part in this exciting new era for regenerative medicine.